Okay, we made it to Omni Riverfront Hotel in New Orleans. We got an Uber from the hotel because the taxi line was way too long. And as soon as we asked for an Uber, they were there. Look, it's so pretty. I like the window. It's we cozy. It. We made it. <laughs> what time is it? 6.30. 6.30. We still got time to explore. Hi. <laughs> Cute. Wow, look at this shower. It's very pretty. I really like this window. I can't wait to see out in the morning. We got a view of the street and the riverfront over there. Can't really see. Biersch is an American brewery founded by Dan Gordon and Dean Biersch. They first opened in Palo Alto, California in July of 1988. I ordered a Hefeweizen, a traditionally unfiltered Bavarian style wheat beer. It's full bodied with notes of banana and clove. And Mike ordered the Marzen, an original Oktoberfest style lager. It's extremely smooth, it has an auburn color and a mildly sweet Munich malt finish. That's an Oktoberfest. Mike's was a 5.5 percent. I mean, mine was 5 percent. Cajun fish tacos. Okay, Gordon Beer. The wait was a little long. I feel like they're really busy and understaffed. I didn't get my silverware or napkins yet, but the food was worth the wait. It's so good. And then I added a little bit of lime to my tacos and made it that much better.
So this is after cleanup. That's Saturday night. After, after Saturday night. They're down there spraying everything off the sidewalks into the street and cars are driving over it right now. They probably do this every day, honestly. It's Bourbon Street for you. We'll come back at night and all these shops are going to be open. Yeah. That's the one I want to go to. there nice beautiful here's one of the bars we can see humidor lounge I like that we came up one floor and there's nobody we're all by ourselves oh babe the atrium so beautiful. I can't believe we're here right now. Hi. Hi. Our first drink on the north. 
Norwegian breakaway. So welcome to our stateroom on the Norwegian breakaway. It's usually not this clean, but I kind of tidied up for the video. <laughs> um, we already put our stuff away in the closet. So I didn't put anything on this side, but there is um, all my backpack in the safe. And then up top, I did put all of our shoes and hung out most of our laundry, all the nice stuff. beds made. You know what I didn't get was a they didn't put a towel in here with a little animal but Mike thinks he'll do it tomorrow. I always like that nice little touch. So there's a nice couch. A couple of drawers underneath the couch. There's also plenty of room underneath the bed which we did store our suitcases under there and some shoes under there. Um, there's no outlets on the side of the bed which I kind of don't like but it's fine we'll put our phones over here there's a couple outlets over here on the desk um, we did already take the time to get online and book all of our shows the second we got in our room so that they'd be um, ready to go for the week and I put them in my phone so that I can get reminders and so that anytime if we're out of the room I can always look up what times we have to be where we only have one excursion booked for this cruise and it's in um, Honduras Roatan Honduras and we're gonna do a tropical brewery tour and they did leave our tickets for that in the room over here on the table um, they also left us with some welcome letters welcome back because we are bronze cruisers which means that this is our second cruise on Norwegian and then our freestyle daily I already went through here it has like the um, times that we want to do um, anything happening so what's happening today? Day one, Sunday, November 27th. I want to do the breakaway sail away celebration at four o'clock. So we're going to do that. It's at the pool side. Um, I'm going to try to do some spa raffle giveaway. I don't think I'll win that, but we'll see. And then um, tonight at Headliners, they have Howl at the Moon Dueling Pianos. Hey babe. Hmm. I'm about to show them our um, balcony. And we're also on um, deck 14. So we're up pretty high. I think there's only 15 decks, 16 decks. Okay. So this is the Mississippi River. It smells a little fishy out here. Beautiful. So tonight when we sail away, we're gonna be kind of winding along the Mississippi River um, for hours tonight. It will, it'll probably be like midnight before we're out in the ocean. So that's cool. 
we got a bunch of bridges we're gonna go under today. Our balcony just has a couple of seats on the table. Just perfect for the two of us. I think we're gonna get ready here and, and head out. Um, I also like this, I was already propping my feet up on it. It's got a little desk almost, a little table, and it's an ottoman, and let's see, it does have an opening, storage. so storage, that's a storage space. There's my hair dryer, which I was concerned about, but it's in every room. A little trash. I'm also going to pay extra for the water package. I think I'm just going to do the six one liter bottles um, for $19.95. Mark that, leave it with my steward. I also have a tip laid out for him. I'm going to give him $40 today and then um, just fill that out. And then there's also 50% off pressing services, which we might do this. We're kind of undecided right now, but I kind of looked through all this already. And then excursions. If you want to do excursions, you can fill them out in this order form and hand that in. But I think we're already all set on those. But there's a lot. And they do have all of our um, ports listed on here. They have Costa Maya, Harvest K, Belize, Roatan, Honduras. That's where we're going to do the um, tropical brewery tour that we have booked that day at 1030. And then Cozumel, Mexico is our last one. Our last day is a day at sea, so then we're back to New Orleans. All right, we're gonna go enjoy. I did not show you the bathroom yet, because Mike was in there, but we can control our thermostat in here. Hey! <laughs> and then our bathroom, it comes with um, soap, shampoo, hand soap, little cups, um, in case you wanna wash your mouth out. Um, let's see, a shower cap and a shower poof to wash with. I did bring a nightlight with, I don't know, I've never done this before, but people were saying that you should bring a nightlight with you on the cruise because it's going to be kind of dark in here at night if you got all the lights off. And then our shower is in our bathroom. On our last Norwegian cruise, it was in a separate room, um, and then they had the toilet and the sink in a different room. Looks like they also have um, one of these lines if you want to hang your swim clothes afterwards or if anything's wet, towels, anything you can hang off there. Um, and they do have shower gel and shampoo. One thing that I don't see is conditioner and I didn't bring any extra with me so I might have to purchase some of that because I like to use a lot of conditioner. They do have a couple extra um, rolls of toilet paper in here, trash is under there, and a couple of towels too. So we're gonna go head out and probably hit up another bar tonight before the party. And then I think we do have a comedy show tonight we're going to go to, so enjoy! Bye.